Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to WW2K20, my career mode. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for stopping by. I greatly appreciate it. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button as hard as you possibly can. If you've been enjoying this series, Red and Trey have been through the thick and the thin. And I feel like it's just going to get thicker. So without further ado, let's get it. Here it is. We have reached, I believe, SummerSlam. Right? Can't really tell by the arena. And are we SummerSlam? <laughs> I can't see. Oh, yep, there it is. The one and only Chris Danger. We got a ladder match against The Miz. The contract for the leading role in rank and file four hangs high above the ring and either Danger or The Miz will be that leading man. Chris Danger's been looking for this opportunity, a breakout role to show the world what he can do. Meanwhile, The Miz does not want to loosen his grasp around the rank and file series. He believes he is the driving force behind those films. And Chris Danger here tonight is about to crush this man's dreams but to do that we gotta climb a ladder we gotta grab a briefcase and i'm certain that there's gonna be some sort of shenanigans going on in this matchup the miz this means so much to this man he's gonna put it all on the line so danger better be ready for a fight coming down the red carpet without further ado people it's ladder match time. Get Miss the yellow health. Okay. No time. Oh, God. Reversal from Miz. Taking down Danger. No time for BS. It's just time for action. Time for fighting. Time for ladders. Time for other weapons as well. Oh, you missed. Come here. Boom. Bam. Ha. Boom. And bam. Connecting on the Miz. Do I want the ladder yet? I don't want the ladder yet. I'm going to wait to get him to yellow health first because I might have another objective that involves getting the ladder. I don't know. Bam, double axe handle missing. Uh-oh. Miz, my God. Slamming danger on the back of his head and continues to do so. Jesus. What did I ever do to you? Here we go. Bam. Cut his legs out from under his legs. Danger. Here at SummerSlam. A big night for this man. Bam. Connecting. Most danger thinking here. He's going to go up top. Danger really doing it all today. Turns around. And a moonsault on the Miz. And a kick for good measure. Yellow health objective completed. Perform a corner strike while Miz is in the corner. All right. Let's get him in the corner. And let's strike him. Yeah. Oh, Christ. It's Brooklyn Von Braun. What does she want? I feeling she'd get involved tonight. Do you blame her? She wants Miz to win so she can have a legitimate co-star in the movie. And here's Red to stop Brooklyn yeah. from spoiling this match. This is pure jealousy. Let's go. Red couldn't beat Brooklyn in the audition, so now she's taking it out on her. That's ridiculous. She's only out here to help her friend, Trey. And it appears she's been able to accomplish that. Red is neutralized, Brooklyn. Oh, no, but whatever, Miz. Nice. Cutting in this match. All right. I thought they were going to screw me. Win the match by grabbing beef fairies. Yes. I'm going to star in a movie. DJ Baby Boy. Can't do nothing to me. DJ Baby Boy. I'm going to get the Miz down. DJ Baby Boy. Grab it. Oh, he wants a ladder too. Oh, he wants a ladder too, does he? Oh, does he? I got it set up in perfect positioning. Come here, Michael. Mizanin, come here. Oh my goodness. Connecting. I want to dive at you on the outside, but I won't do it. I won't do it because I don't know if I have suicide dive. Yeah. Come here. Ah, get down. Danger takes the Miz down. What's he going to do here? He's going to climb the ladder. He's going to start the ascent. The contract lies. Oh, God. This 
Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. There's one. There's oh God. Two. Two. Crap. Cancel. Oh Miz. Big right hands. No. Reversed. They're both at the top of the ladder. No man's land. Reversal after reversal. Chop to Miz. Another one. Oh no. Blocked. I got no reversals. I got one more. That chop doesn't do anything, Chris. Bam. Chop. And he's down. And he's down. He knocks the Miz off the ladder. Oh my God. Why am I so bad at this? Uh, ha, nope. Ha, nope. Huh? Are you kidding me? Huh? Are you it's so easy to stay <laughs> Are you serious? Two more. Two more. WWE One more. Facebook One more. Page. Danger is the leading man. Whoo! No matter how you feel about anyone's acting skills, this is a huge night for Trey. Let's go. A future Hall of Famer in a pressure-filled, high-stakes ladder match at the biggest party in the summer. As far as I'm concerned, Trey deserves the role and our respect. Now that's nice, but as of now, I'm officially boycotting rank and file four. Sorry, Brooklyn. I'll just have to catch you in your next film. Rank and file four. Starring Chris Danger, so star in a WWE action movie. We can cross that off the list. What a night and what an achievement for Danger. Oh, we got some unlockables here. Okay, we unlocked the Miz, mocap suit, movie set, bat, tripod, sledgehammer, and kendo stick. How about that? All right, backstage on Raw, we got Red, we got Charlotte Flair, or continue story. I don't see Charlotte anywhere. <laughs> so uh, let's talk to Red, I guess. Hey, thanks for the assist out there. And by the way, now that I've officially got the part again, it's not too late for me to pull some strings and get you a roll. I think I'm cool with sitting this one out. All right, well, the door's open if I'm back for rank and file five. Although I heard R-Truth pitch the producers on making it an office drama with him as a star and it's under strong consideration, so we'll see. Mm. Oh, by the way, I left tickets for my real parents again. No luck though. Still doing that, huh? Yep. And who knows, maybe if they're not WWE fans, then they'll see me in the movie. Can't hurt. Yeah, I guess. Hey, before you go out for your match, you mind signing my script? <laughs> sure. May you always have a happy Thanksgiving. See? <laughs> it is catching on. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. This man with his Thanksgiving. Oh dear. All right, uh, Charlotte, I guess? Who's hiding somewhere, apparently? Oh! Lovely. That's just wonderful. <laughs> Color me surprised. Oh, uh, if I lost all my sh I'm gonna be upset. Oh, and look, there's Charlotte. Uh, do I even want to talk to her? <sighs> now I have to. Busy night for you, huh? I mean, if I were defending my title against an opponent like me, I might be just a little more focused on my match. You weren't even here 30 seconds. Oh. Don't worry. I'm more than capable of helping a friend out and beating you in the same night. Well, while you've been off auditioning for movies and getting in fights with your old high school bully, I've been training for our match. You see, it's become a bit personal for me. You might even say I feel disrespected by your attitude. It's like everything's easy for you, huh? You show up in WWE and just waltz your way to the top? Well, that makes me angry. All right, because that's never happened to anyone else, huh, Charlotte Flair? Okay. Didn't you do the exact <laughs> same thing? Look at me and Brooke on the same wavelength. <laughs> not even close. You're right. It's not the same. Because I didn't have a famous dad to help me get here. I've earned everything I have. Mm -hmm. There it is again. Disrespect. And speaking of that, beating me is not even on your list as far as I can tell. Because it's, it's not worth being on the list? I, I only put my goals on there, not things I expect to do. Boom. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, after tonight you'll have a new goal to put on your list. 
take back the Raw Women's Championship from Charlotte Flair. Ooh, play match versus Charlotte, skip match. No, you, my game, you broke my game. No, I'm not fighting you. You broke my game. Continue the damn story, please. I'm out of here. <laughs> Ooh, what up, ladies? Can you believe they're all the way up to rank and file seven now? No, I can't. I thought they would have stopped making them after your performance. Wow. Didn't realize this was a roast. No, it's just that you definitely had some interesting priorities earlier in your career. First, it was the movie. Then, you were obsessed with getting your own action figure. It was on the list since day one. Yeah, which made you super jealous when I got one before you did. Remember this? <laughs> Are you still a little bit jealous? No. <laughs> Are you sure? I think you're exaggerating how I reacted. <laughs> really? Because that's not how I remember it. Uh-oh, action figure time. Now we're talking. Check it out, my first action figure. Pretty cool, right? Awesome. They really nailed the detail in your face. Mm. You didn't even really look at it. Yeah, well, you know what they say about action figures. Once you've seen one, you've seen them all. <laughs> Literally no one says that. He's salty. Wait, are you jealous because you don't have one yet? No, I'm fine. Okay, look, I get it. This was more your thing, but it's just an action figure. It's more than that to me. Think of how you felt when I won a title in WWE before you did. It's like that, but 10 times worse. <laughs> Comparing titles to action figures might be a little extreme, but if it makes you feel any better, I'll wait and let you cross it off our list whenever you get one. No, it's fine, cross it off. You earned it. Oh dear. I see you got your first action figure. We've had like 30 now, so it's kind of boring at this point. Where's yours? I think he didn't get one. <laughs> well, that's awkward. Mm. I think even like Tom Phillips got one. <laughs> he doesn't really deserve it. <laughs> well, that's true. He's lucky even to be on the roster. <clears throat> Sorry, we got sidetracked with a private conversation that had absolutely nothing to do with you. But since apparently you don't have an action figure, we like to give you ours. Happy Rusev Day! Mm. Do you think he heard what we said? Who cares? He's a loser. <laughs> oh, really? Freaking jerks, and if I had an action figure of my own, I would team up with Red's action figure to kick your action figure, stupid plastic butts. Or even better, how about we take them down in real life? Huh? Oh, yeah. I guess we could do that. Where's Bobby Lashley when you need him? Bye bye. Looks like we got some mixed tag action tonight. Danger and Danger versus Rusev and Lana. It sucks we don't come. Why don't we come out together? Why is there not a Why is there not a joint tag team animation slash entrance slash whatever? I mean, I probably know the answer to that, but I don't want to think about it. All right. Bam, bam. Brooke Danger. Current Raw Women's Champion. Teams up with her best friend slash kayfabe brother slash whatever this is to do battle with Rusev and Lana. Are we ready for this? I'm not really sure. I'm sure some sort of nonsense is gonna go down in this match. Action figures at stake. Danger really wants his own action figure. I really want my own action figure, so I, it's, it's, it works, it fits. But, is there any way for these two to take, y'all don't even come out together either? Rusev and Lana don't come out together? You don't have a, 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 a superstar slash manager entrance slash tag? Animation? What? Who? who hey, made? Okay. They were add a, uh, okay. I'm just asking questions. Rusev Day has arrived, and his tag team partner, his currently estranged wife slash ex slash something about I don't know what's going on these days. All I know is Lana was talking a lot of trash about that action figure. 
and Brooke knows just how much that means to Chris. So for that, she's going to snatch some wigs. I said it. I went there. Without further ado, two on two. It's time to do it. No objective. What? No objective. Come here. Ah, you thought I wouldn't do it. Action <laughs> figures. Oh God, Rusev like a freight train. And now, oh look at this, just like that. Danger rolls out of the ring and here comes Brooke. Now I believe, yeah, I can hit Rusev. But Chris cannot hit Lana. Drop kick to Lana. We got two reversals left, Brooke's got, how does Brooke have four reversals? And Chris only has three. I, like, I leveled up the same type of stuff, actually like for most of them for the most part. Spinning kick from Brooke. And then Segura to the back of the neck. Take a good look, Rusev. She's getting a booty whooped right here, right now. Come on, Rusev. I know a, a small part of you has to be appreciating <laughs> everything this woman has put you through. Think about, think about what she's been doing with Bobby. Think about it. I know how you feel. I know how you feel, Rusev. You just want me to whoop. That booty really to get a little bit of revenge. Kick to the lower back. And Brooke is doing just that. She's got control of this contest. And actually, it honestly makes sense to use Brooke for this match. That way we can knock Rusev off the apron. That way we don't gotta worry about uh, any tag team breaking upage of the pins, which I can't stand. Oh, Lana. With a big time reversal though. Oh, Brooke. Saw it coming. Oh, Lana wasted her reversals. Lana's not, uh, not too great at this. Lana's not too good at this. Here we go. Bam. Takes her down. The ravishing Russian. Getting destroyed by the red one. How about this? Another kick to the back. Stomp. 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 Waste it. Waste it. Come on. Waste it. Come on. Waste it. Come on. Waste it. Oh, she didn't waste it. That's all right, though. Brooke. Bam, bam. Come here. Come here. Come here. Right here. Oh, crap. Let me do that. <laughs> Irish whip. Oh, a big back elbow. No, no, Tick. Oh, no. Oh, that's unfortunate. No, no, grip. Oh. They took me Tick for and she immediately tags Rusev. And she goes after Danger. What a takedown from Lana. Oh, she reversed my signature. I reversed her. That's, that's unfortunate. Bam. That's hilarious. No, she reversed it again. Are you serious? Oh, reversing you though. She's got her. Oh, she's gonna roll her up. Roll her up. One. Oh, kick out. So, so he can break up pins. Okay, I thought, I thought maybe like they wouldn't. Oh, I took them both out. I took them both out with one fell swoop. One fell swoop. Lana. Oh, I don't think she's gonna tap. I don't think she's gonna tap. Lana's hanging on by a thread. Here comes Rusev. Oh, and he talks to the ref to break it up. Hey, Bulgarian Brute, look at me. You can't touch me, you can't do nothing. I could just talk trash right in your face. And then boop! Come here, Lana! Lining it up! Wait for it! Oh! Never mind. Uh, never mind. Lana has a finisher. I repeat, Lana has a finisher. Never mind. No, she don't. But I do! Brad Ladder! And I punched the Rusev! It's over! The dangers are victorious! Woo! Damn! That almost went south. That almost went south quickly. And there was no question about that one. What a victory for Chris and Brooke. Teaming together on Monday Night Raw, and I gotta believe that Chris is one step closer to his own action figure. Let's get it. 
In all seriousness, even though it wasn't as important to me, it was pretty cool when not long after that, you got your first action figure and crossed it off our list. But the fact we had different priorities is partly what made this work, because let's be honest, if we'd been competing for the same things, I'm not sure we could have been friends. You were just always so driven to be the best. Maybe, but it's not like I was only focused on individual goals. Like, what about when we went to SmackDown Live and I ended up teaming with someone who was a great influence and mentor to me? I'm talking about Mickey James, of course! Stand up and take a bow, Mickey, you deserve it. <laughs> the dude she's with. Like, oh, me too? Oh, okay, never mind. No, not me. <laughs> All right, so we get to cross off tag with Mickey James off the list because that was one of Brooks, uh, Brooks' big things. So I'm glad they were able to achieve it. Let's see it. You fought hard, but it just wasn't your night. Let's face it, it hasn't been your night in a long time. Now, as general manager of SmackDown Live, it's my job to present a cutting edge product, which means constantly introducing new talent to keep our brand fresh and exciting. But we can't add new talent without making subtractions. So I'm sorry, Mickey, but based on your recent performance, you can either announce your retirement or unfortunately, I'll have to make that decision for you. Yikes. Wait, so you're basically forcing her out? She deserves better than that. I understand where you're coming from. But like I said, this is bigger than one person. It's about protecting the brand. There would be no brand without women like Mickey James. You know what, it's okay, it's okay. Uh, I've been doing this a long time and maybe I've lost a step. Maybe it's just time to hang it up. No, you can't just accept this. There has to be another way. Well, there is one other option, but it would just be delaying the inevitable. Mickey can continue competing on SmackDown Live as long as she wins. But the very next match she loses, is her last. She'll do it. I will. All right. Good luck. Look, I appreciate the support, but with my record as of late, I don't think I'll be sticking around too long. Or maybe you will with me by your side. Oh, what do you mean? Big Show didn't say you had to win singles matches. Are you sure you want to set aside your own goals to do this? There's nothing I'd rather do than protect your legacy by sending you out on a winning streak and one last title run. Win women's tag team championships with Mickey James. Oh, snap. We're making an addendum to the list. I like where this is going. Welcome, everyone, to the most iconic talk show ever. Iconic talk with your hosts, <laughs> the Iconics. We just said Iconic so many times. You said it again. I think we just set a record. Speaking of records, I want to remind everyone that we are now the longest running women's tag team champions ever from Australia. They're also the only women's tag team champions from Australia. Which brings us to my favorite segment of Iconic Talk, it's time for Why, Why Australia, Australia is Better. better. <laughs> this is a part of the show where we educate our audience on different aspects of Australian culture and explain Why Australia is Better. Okay, what do we have this week? The great sport of cricket. Which has nothing to do with filthy little insects. No, it's actually a sport that is very popular in Australia. Think of it like a way better version of your horrible, dull baseball. Mm. To further educate you oh, on Jesus. this superior sport, let's go over the laws of cricket, shall we? There are only 42 of them. Shouldn't take long. Law one, a cricket team consists of 11 players, including a captain. That's a great law, one of my favorites. <laughs> now, law two. What the hell? Oh, snap. Hey, what are these two doing out here? There were still 41 laws to go. I wanted to learn more about cricket. I think you were the only one. Law two. The Iconics should never be allowed to have a talk show as it'll put everyone watching to sleep. 
That's not an actual law. Yeah, don't listen to her. Why are you two even out here? It's very rude to interrupt someone's talk show. I recommend you go back and watch this segment we did on manners. <laughs> We're here because we want a tag team championship match. So you two are a team now. <laughs> what are you calling yourselves? Red and grey. Oh, jeez. <laughs> because Mickey's so old. Get it? Hilarious. She really is a fossil. You've never even teamed before. So what makes you think you deserve a shot at our titles? Maybe because eight years ago in Calgary, I beat you in my very first match. And I've only gotten better since then. Way better. Oh, okay. So you're saying since a long time ago, I felt bad for my pathetic opponent and basically took the night off because I was freezing. That a decade later, when that pathetic opponent rears her ugly head with an elderly partner, they deserve a tag title opportunity? Makes sense. <laughs> that was sarcasm. The answer is no. <laughs> if you think that we need to prove ourselves as a team, then we'll do it right now in a non-title match. If we win, we get a championship match. And if you win, you end my career. That whole career-ending stipulation is enticing. Yeah, I forgot about that. It would be nice to put her out to pasture. We'll do it. But only after we finish teaching everyone about cricket. Law three. Never interrupt the Iconics. Oh no! Bring it, bats! The Iconics Ow. viciously attack Red and Mickey with those cricket bats! <laughs> and rightfully so, they violated Law 3. Red and Mickey are going to be at a severe disadvantage going into this match with so much at stake. Oh no, severe disadvantage? What does that mean? If you're just joining us, this is All a right. title match. As Red win the match by pinfall or submission. All right, that's fine. Oh, look, our midsection's already yellow. Oh, we start in yellow health, too. Oh, that sucks. All right. So the only objective, only stipulation here is just to win the match, but we got to do it as Red, not as Mickey. That's fine with me. I wasn't really planning on tagging her in anyway. So it is what it is. Oh, look, Billy K, you only got one payback, and you can't use it. Doesn't that suck? How about a power bomb? The sit-out version. And look, Peyton, one of your paybacks is unusable as well. Y'all really didn't prepare for this match very well, did you? Oh, God. Nice reversal from Billy. That's okay. Clothesline, psych. Kick to the midsection. Got her in the corner. Clothesline out of the ring. Out of the ring. Goes Billy K. Up to your feet. Just watch this. Just watch this. Just watch this. Here it comes. Here it comes. Okay. Here comes. I really thought I had a suicide dive. I guess I don't. <laughs> I'm gonna have to double check that. Oh, swing and a miss. Grab her here. How about that? Bam! Right on the back of her neck. And Billy Kay is in serious trouble. Come here, girl. Get up. Get up. Get up. Stand up. Come on, throw your hands up. The Iconics. Not looking too iconic at the moment. As Brooke is whooping that booty to the corner. And then to the corner. Mm. Nope. You tried it. She tried it. Bam, knock her down. Sometimes love comes around. And it knocks you down. Just get back up when it knocks you down. All right. It's danger if you're nasty. Let's see it. Flip it up. Ha! impact. Connecting on Billy K. Oh, you really wanted that hot tag, didn't you? Oh, you really thought about it. You really thought you were getting that hot tag. That's cute. Irish whip. Come here. Back. Body. Drop. Kick to the back. I know she ain't gonna tap out, but I'm gonna hit her with it anyway. I'm gonna hit her with it anyway. Watch out for it. Watch out, girl. Yes. Locked in. Locked in. Dragon sleeper. Sleeper, baby. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, and Peyton Royce has to come break it up. Because it's the only option she had. See ya. Oh. Sit. Sit. See ya. Come here, Billy. Come. 
Tommy Billy. Billy boy. Oh no! She reversed the red letter. Son of a. Damn it. Damn it. I had her too. Oh, I had Billy K beat. I had this woman beat. Damn. Damn. Get off me. Get off me. Missed the clothesline. Missed that clothesline. Forearm. No. No hot tag. No hot tag. Damn. We had her. Oh, I had her beat. It's unfortunate. So she reversed the red letter. And now Brooke is just pissed off. Peyton's down on the outside. Oh, oh. so maybe Brooke's going to steal it. One, two. Oh, nope. Peyton diving into the ring. Watch out, ref. Here we go now. Suplex City from Brooke. And still trying to get that hot tag. Oh, damn it. Darn it. Damn it, darn it. She had to finish her butt. Didn't use it. She's really got to tag out. But she ain't going to get the chance. Sit out. Powerbomb. And a rope break. And a rope break. But she can't tag if Peyton's in the ring. That's one good thing. That's one good thing. We got to watch out for that finisher she's got, though. Insiguri to the back of the neck. Again, trying to get that hot tag. Elbow to the back. Okay. Brooke again. Looking Peyton. You want some of this? You want some of that? Connecting with Peyton. Billy trying to get back to her feet. Ha. Brooke's got this in the bag, as they say. She's got to keep an eye out for Peyton again. Peyton back to the apron. Psych! 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 Locked in! Oh, rope break my ball. My oh, rope break my ass cheeks. Oh, come on. That was not a rope break. Hey, Peyton. What'd it do? How you feeling today, baby boo? Bye! And right now she reversed it again! Are you serious? Two times reversing the red letter. But hang on! Crucifix pin! One! Two! Oh, Peyton was there too. Peyton was ready for that one. Wow. That is unfortunate. That is two red letters that have been reversed by Billy Kay. This match could have done been over. Could have done been over. Stomp. 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 Hey, Peyton. See you. Just wearing these Iconics down all by myself. Don't worry about it, Mickey. I got this. I got this. Oh, she just popped right back up, did you? Oh, that's what you thought. Crucifix. One, two. Oh, and Peyton breaks it up. Brooke didn't appreciate that. Brooke didn't appreciate that. Turns her attention to Peyton Royce. Oh, my goodness on the hardest part of the ring. Billy Kay, you think I'm playing around? Bam! We are not playing around today. Ah. And who? Alright, Billy. I'm sorry to say your night is over! Got it locked in! No rope break this time! No rope break this time! Oh no, Peyton! Get it! Oh! Peyton breaks it up. Peyton. Come here, girl. Let's go. All right, I need Billy to get rid of some of these uh, reversals, please. That's two. All right, she got rid of two of them. The takedown to Brooke. Back body drop. Back body drop. Let me see that body drop. Come on, Billy. Come on, waste another one. Waste another one. Waste another one. Waste it. Waste it. Waste it. Damn it. If she reverses this again, I can't even explain to you how upset I'm going to be. I can't even begin 
to explain how upset I'm gonna be. I need her to come towards me. I need her to come towards me. Actually, not gonna hit it yet. Not yet. Punch. See, she would have reversed it. She would have reversed it. She had that reversal ready. Nice kick. Oh, wait. What is this? Yeah, OMG. Hang on. Close line. Wait a second. Are we gonna see Brooke? Oh, my goodness. The dive to the outside. And a this is awesome chant. Oh, uh oh. A Billy K. No. Here we go after the OMG. One, two. Oh, kick out from Billy again. I cannot believe it. Peyton, get off the ring. Get off the apron. Billy K is putting this match on her back, putting this team on her back. Irish whip to the corner. And here comes Brooke. Aggressively just choking out Billy Kay. And the stomps. Oh man, what's it gonna take? Hi. Took her down. Took her down. We got Billy now. Come here, Billy. Oh, she reversed my sing! She is reversing everything! And a body slam. Stomp. Stomp. Oh, she wants the oh she wants the hot tag. You thought. You thought. Brooke Danger is really doing it all in this match, to be honest. To be completely frank. This has been all Brooke. And Billy can't do a damn thing about it. break where where's the rope break where is it bam get up billy this has got to be it this has to be it there's no way oh my gosh you reversed it again are you serious you have got to be kidding me oh and a forearm it's a gary missed Nice. Nice. Reversal again. And another crucifix. One. Two. Oh my god, she's got a gray head. Why won't she stay down? What the hell? Oh, Irish whip from... From, uh, Billy Kay. I don't know why I just blanked on her name for a second. You thought. Drop kick. I, I, I'm in the, um, at a loss for words, people. I'm shocked. I cannot believe this match is actually still going on. Oh, look at this. Head scissors. And that finally takes Brooke down. And I believe, son of a bitch. I had this match won three times. You have got to be kidding me. Unbelievable. Super kick to the stomach. From Peyton, I, I, I'm, I'm so agitated right now. <laughs> I cannot believe that. What is that long kick animation that takes her forever to do? Oh God! All this. Wait, tag her back in. Tag her back in. Do a grapple. Tag her back in. Oh really? Y'all don't tag each other for grapples? What's wrong with y'all? Supposed to be a team. Supposed to be a team. I cannot believe what this match has come to. This is the Inziguri. Oh my God. Suddenly the Iconics. Oh my God. <laughs> kick to the midsection. I'll oh, kick to the lower leg. Uh oh. Wish I could call my partner in to do something like the good old days. Gotta get that second reversal back though. Can't waste my only reversal I have here. Never mind. I had to. I had to. Bam. I thought I got the second one. Inseguri to Peyton Royce. Jesus, this has been all Brooke. Mickey James a little 
a little, what's the word I'm looking for? Lacking in confidence as of late. Oh, Billy, you really reverse everything? Holy God, man. <laughs> Reversal on Peyton. Chop block takes her out. Over to Billy. Oh my God. Bam. Goes for the pin on Peyton. And a quick kick out at one. This has been, for some reason, <laughs> a barn burner of a match. And the titles aren't even on the line. We don't even have the titles on the line. This is a non-title match that I started at. Yellow Elf. Watch out. Watch out. Red letter! To Peyton! Bye-bye, Billy! Is that finally enough? One, two, three. Oh, man. Brooke and Mickey James victorious over the Iconics. What we just saw there was a doctorate. That means these two have won a title opportunity against the Iconics, who are no slouches. Can these two take the titles in their next match? Woo! That was awesome! And considering our lack of experience together, I'd say we make a pretty good team. I agree. I mean,. You know what, I just want to say thank you for doing this. I could be sitting at home right now, but instead we have a chance to win the tag team championships. And even if my career does end, this is a heck of a way to go out. Before you celebrate too much, we just found out your tag title match will be taking place on our home turf. That's right, in our great country, in front of our fans at Super Showdown. It doesn't matter, we'll beat you anywhere. Oh, you should also know it's going to be an Australian rules tag match, which are the most iconic rules. What does that even mean? It means it'll be no disqualification, tornado tag. Or willy willy tag, as we say down under. Hey, Mickey, you should pack an extra week of clothes. You know, so you can go on holiday in Australia after we end your career. We'll call our grandparents and see if they know of any good senior resorts. Yes. <laughs> that is mean. Don't be a bully, be a star, okay? What happened to that? Oh boy. Well, nobody's in the locker room. Everybody left. <laughs> Here all by myself. All by myself. Ladies and gentlemen, Thank you so much for stopping by. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button as hard as you possibly can. Coming up next, women's tag team titles will be on the line at Super Showdown. Plenty more to come. Don't miss it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.